welcome back. So today we're talking all about Easter decor and specifically the best Dollar Tree Easter decor finds this year. Over the past week or so, I've been going around to the Dollar Trees around me, seeing what they have for Easter, and I wanna share all with you what I think are the best finds for Easter this year. So let's hop into it. Hop into it, bunny, hop, Easter. I didn't even do that on purpose, but you know, fitting. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, what goes with Easter more than Easter egg? Dollar Tree always has a bunch of cute little plastic eggs, you know, that you put the candy in or coins or whatever you do to fill them up for egg hunts. And this year I've seen so many new ones that I've never seen before. So I wanna share what I've seen. So one of the first ones that I got that I've never seen before there are six in here and they are little like trucks or cars. Here, there, let, let, me, let me take it out of the back. They're colorful and that's just the cutest little thing I've ever seen. I mean, you can totally fit some little candy in there. That is so cute. My littlest daughter, she loves like little trucks and cars and stuff. So I thought these would be so cute for her and Six for a dollar twenty-five. Now I did just do a Walmart shop with me in my last video, and I shared a bunch of eggs there. Some of those, if you're just looking for like basic, plain, you know, plastic eggs, you can probably get a better deal. They have some there that are ninety-eight cents. As we know, Dollar Tree, I think everywhere now. Let me know in the comments below. Is your Dollar Tree a dollar twenty-five? I think they've all gone to a dollar twenty-five but I know all of mine are. So if you're just wanting some basic ones, Walmart or something like that might be a better option for you. But some of these more specialty ones, I think $1.25 for these little cute race cars is a great deal. Along with some other like little specialty ones, these are so cute. They have this little face on them, like a little Easter bunny. There's four pieces in here, so not too many. But if you just wanna have some fun with some different ones, I thought these were a really cute find. Another one that I thought was so cute that I've never seen Dollar Tree do before, there are eight of them in here, are these little dessert ones. They look like little cupcakes. They're so cute. These look like little cupcakes and then they have some down here that look like I don't know, just like little desserts. They're adorable. I just thought there was something different. We are definitely due for some new plastic eggs. I've had mine forever, and I'm just going to use these to um, actually do an egg hunt. But you could, if you wanted, take like these little bunny ones and spray paint them and use these as like little filler or decoration, which, should I do something like that? I don't know. There are, definitely are some cute little DIYs you could do with these. These next ones were so pretty. I, I got two packs of them because I just think they're gorgeous. They're like a very, oh, I don't even know. I mean, they're clear, but they have like these colors with them. I'm doing a horrible job explaining what these look like. Look how pretty that is. I am obsessed with these. This green one. So pretty. Look at this pink one, so pretty. I love these. And then this blue one, so pretty. These are definitely my favorite, I think, this year at Dollar Tree. They had a whole bunch of other eggs too, so definitely hit up your Dollar Tree if you need some eggs. That is one of the best things that you can get at Dollar Tree for Easter. Okay, something that I found new this year I've never seen before at Dollar Tree is this Big ol' bunny. How cute is this? This definitely has to be one of the best Easter finds you can get at Dollar Tree this year. This is so big for something that Dollar Tree has. It has the little feet right here. It's really like pretty good quality for $1.25. It has like, can you hear that? It's like um, some kind of like, not bean, like a, how like a bean bag stuff? No, it's not bean bag. But it just like weighs it down a little bit. So it'll stand like upright so cute this bunny is adorable i love him and i'm pretty sure this bunny is going to be sold out very quickly so if you see one at your dollar tree i would go ahead and snag this up because this is a great find you could just stick it in an easter basket for an added little touch which would be super cute also this would make really cute decor on a little shelf i'm definitely going to have this out in an area where I want some decor, but I need it to be like kid friendly for my Agnoia. This is such a great Easter find at Dollar Tree this year. I'm obsessed, so cute. I feel like I wanna name him. What is your name? What do 
you want your name to be? We'll think of it. Another great thing at Dollar Tree right now for Easter, they always do a great job with this, are their little gift bags. They have so many cute little gift bags, but I love these little canvas ones this year. They're little, so you can't put a whole bunch in it. There's two of them, but they are so cute. They have these little ears, which are just so adorable, and then the little bunny face and it has a little drawstring so you can close it. If you're doing a little care package for someone or you have something that you're putting in an Easter basket that you wanna just add something little into here, I think that would be so cute. Obviously, you could just stuff this and use it as decor sitting on a shelf or a coffee bar or anything like that. There's so many little things you could do with this. I think this is such a great find for $1.25. All right, we know signs at Dollar Tree are always a plenty and this year they had a bunch of signs that I've seen before but then a bunch of new signs that I've never seen before and I got some really cute ones so the best ones that I think right now that I picked up okay this one I am like shook do people even say that anymore <laughs> probably not but I am very impressed with this one look how cute, sorry the lighting's changing. It's like gonna start raining, I think, but look how big it is, okay? This is such a nice size sign. It has the little cotton ball things, the little bunny ears. I love the pastel colors. I'm a pastel girl for Easter, I love it. Give me all the pastels for Easter. Don't send me neutral, I'm not doing it. I'm going pastels and this is perfect. I think it's so cute. I love the sign. If you see this, I think you should grab it. Obviously, if you didn't want to go with the pastels, you could totally DIY this. You could take the little cotton balls off, DIY it, paint it, and then add the cotton balls back in. It's just a great little outline as well with the little bunny ears and everything. So I think this is such a great find for Easter. This might not be new. I honestly, I'm not sure. There's a very good chance I could pull out my Easter decor and find this because there's a part of me that feels like he looks familiar, but then there's a part of me that's like, mm, I don't know. Regardless, he is so cute. I love his face so much. I actually think I'm going to do a little DIY with him, not much, but I think I'm going to take this off and maybe put him in an actual frame, but you can also put this with a, um, a wreath, something like that, or just put it straight up on your wall. Um, but like I said, I think I want to put him in a little frame. I have one of Dollar Tree's 11 by 14 frames and I'm going to give that a little shot. Again, you can do so much with these. You can DIY them and add more to them or just leave them as is, but he's so cute. I definitely think even if he's not new, he's a great buy at Dollar Tree for Easter this year because look at his face. I mean, how freaking cute is he? <laughs> okay, these two signs were definitely new to me and I got them both in the pink and the blue. Now, when you look at these, you have to be careful. I just realized like this one's a little off center. They did not make all of these the same. There are some that look a little like off. And like I said, you can see if you look closely, this um, middle thing comes off and it's just a little crooked but i love the i love the wood and i love the pattern behind here with the pink and then the little raised wording right here it says bunny trail farms farm fresh eggs and produce established 1925 which would have been so cute because my house was built in 1913 i was like oh man we were so close to it. i mean not really that close to it saying 1913 but it was like not too far off and I thought man that would have been so cute if it was a 1913 anyways um yeah I think it's just the sign is super cute so I love this I love also using their signs like using their little picture holders and setting their signs on there and putting it on a shelf or on a table or something like that so that's what I'm probably going to do with some of these I have lots of little built-in shelves and stuff in this house so I wanted to get some little decor like this to fill it up I think this is such a great sign as well as this one that is like the brother to it it's got the blue back and this one says a little bit something different it's Cottontail Farms Easter Market Bunny Trails Carrots and Candy Bunny Parking and Back just so cute I think man picture like a little a little shelf and like having this sitting there and the, like the little bunny and then maybe like some eggs around it like 
these are good Easter finds. You can create really cute little Easter vignettes with this stuff. I am I can't wait to start decorating. All right, there's one other little sign that I picked up. The galvanized uh, little part of it just came off, so I'll have to glue that back. But this is great for a little tiered tray or just like a little shelf, but it says bunny bait, fresh carrots. How cute is that? This is the little galvanized piece that came off, so that's supposed to just sit right there. Um, so again, I'll just glue that back, but I just thought this was too cute. This would be so cute in a little tear tray and then like have some little carrots sitting around it and then have some like little eggs, maybe a little bunny. Oh my gosh, this will definitely be really cute in a little tear tray. Since we were just talking about a tear tray, I specifically got these for a tear tray. I've never seen these little carrots before. I think they're so cute. They'll look super cute in a little tear tray. It's almost like a little bottle brush tree, but obviously it's made like to look like a carrot. These would also be really cute if you're doing like a little Easter care package and you're wrapping it and you want to like tie this on as like embellishment on the wrapping. I think that would be really cute to do with these as well. They have, it looks like it's like a little, you know, twine to hang an ornament, like hang it as an ornament. So if you have an Easter tree, these would be cute on it. I don't know how many people have Easter trees. However you want to use it, I think this is a great find for Easter this year at Dollar Tree as well. The next thing up that I love for Easter at Dollar Tree this year are these little moss bunnies. Oh my gosh, let's open them up. There's three in a pack. I feel like they've had moss bunnies before, but I don't think like this. I am in love with these little guys. Do you ever do this when you go to Dollar Tree and you're like, I love this so much, I have to get it. And then you realize you should have gotten like four packs of these because what you think you want to use them for, you realize that you don't have near enough and then you can't find it again. Um, that's what I feel like is going to happen with me and these dang Easter bunnies. But I'm going to go on the hunt for these because I think these would be so cute on an Easter spring tablescape and use this on like the dishes. I think that would be and like... It almost looks like the bunny is like holding something. So if you could do like a little like place card right there or have it sitting on like a, a the little napkin, these would also be great in a little tear tray as well. If you see them, I definitely think pick up maybe a couple packs of them because I think you will find a lot of ways you can use these cute little moss bunnies. All right, you know Dollar Tree always has Easter candy out. It's a great place to go to get Easter candy to put in some baskets to use as decoration. And I found this one specific little chocolate thing that I have to use as decoration in my coffee bar. He is so cute. Are you ready for him? Oh my gosh. Can you see his little face? I can't even with this guy. <laughs> I just think that I have to find a little place for him in my coffee bar set up for Easter. I'm not sure even how I'm doing my coffee bar, but... One of my favorite things to do every holiday is to decorate my coffee bar. So I saw him, I saw his face, we fell in love, and I think he's so cute. This would also be cute to use, in a, obviously, in like an Easter basket. When I saw him, I was like, I just want to look at you every morning when I get my coffee. So <laughs> we're going to make him look real cute in there. Dollar Tree obviously has lots of other Easter candy and bunnies. But in my opinion, I think this one's the best one if you're looking for a cute impact. Not necessarily how it's going to taste. I don't know about that. But cuteness factor this guy wins. <laughs> okay, another thing that I think is such a great find for Easter this year is this little carrot stick thing that you can stick in a plant or stick in the ground as a yard stake. Lots of different things you could do with this. I'm sure you could DIY some stuff, but I thought this would be really cute sticking out of my little plant that I have coming in from my back door that we use. I thought it'd just be a little festive feel as you walk in. So I think this, it feels like pretty heavy duty. Like I think this is gonna hold up pretty well. I think if you had it outside, like in the elements, not under a porch or a cover or something, it might not do as well. Although I might put this out front now that I think about it. I don't know, not out front, on my front porch. You can definitely find some cute places to use these. I think this is a great Dollar Tree Easter find for this year. I don't think I've ever seen it before, so definitely happy I found it. So this is another little pick that you can put inside of a plant or a basket that you make, whatever you wanna do. But these are so cute, they're little bunny paw picks. 
and again you just stick it right in it's got the little feet so I thought this would be really cute to pair with this so it's like a carrot sticking out of the plant and the bunny like jumped in the plant you know and I thought that just be really cute together I think these are a great find again they're cute to add into a little arrangement if you do a little Easter arrangement or if you just have plants around your house and you just want to add like a little festive feel to your plants just stick a little bunny paw in there and it livens it right up makes it feel festive so cute these are such a great find for $1.25 at Dollar Tree I love them one more great find that I think Dollar Tree has for Easter right now are there wood decor is there wood decor dollar trees wood decor they have so much cute wood decor right now if you're looking for some wood decor pieces or you want to do some arts and crafts with your kids which maybe i should have done that magnolia probably would have loved to do that and she could have done it with linen dang i always see i think about things after and i'm like I needed more, gosh darn it. Uh, but yeah, lots of really cute wood decor pieces at Dollar Tree for Easter too. Okay, my last best Easter find at Dollar Tree for this year, 2022, I think are these egg garlands. They have definitely had egg garlands in the past. I don't remember them being quite this substantial. It's this long for $1.25. I think that's a great deal if you have a table with some books on it and just kind of lay that, similar to how people use like wood beads. On a shelf you can style these, on a mantle you can style these. So many ways you can style these. You can paint them, you can, I don't know what else you, you can wear them as a necklace. I don't think you can go wrong with them. So many ways that you can use them. And I personally cannot wait to use them. I can't wait to start decorating with all of this. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I think are the best finds for Easter at Dollar Tree this year. Let me know in the comments below what was your favorite find from this or is there an Easter find that I forgot to mention that I didn't see at one of my Dollar Trees that you think is one of the best ones at Dollar Tree for this year. Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Also, feel free to share the video if you know someone that loves Easter decor, decorating Dollar Tree and you think they might enjoy the video. I can't wait to start decorating my house for Easter. I'm going to be sharing some decorate with me is so stay tuned you can see how I put all the stuff together in my house if you like that sort of thing but other than that that's all I have for you today thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye